Oh. Y'all was looking for me? I'm back. <laughs> That's how you know I haven't done a YouTube video in a minute. Because I can't talk. Hello everyone. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you never been here before, you're in for a treat, you're in for a ride. Don't even waste your time. Hit that subscribe button. Like, <laughs> that's all we're going to focus on right now because we are literally on the road to 10K. Y'all see I'm close. So just help us sister out. Hit that subscribe button. And I promise you, you won't be sorry. But today, we're going to do another, another Pinterest recreation video. You guys love them. I see the views, so I see that's what y'all want. So I'm going to keep giving this to y'all. And I love making them too because I love recreating outfits and, you know, searching, hunting, and finding the right pieces on these different websites. Um, definitely, definitely, definitely comment down below any other stores you want me to shop at to recreate some different outfits. Or you guys can DM me outfits that you guys want me to recreate. Let me know. Just let me know. And I got y'all. But today, we are going to be recreating Pinterest outfits using items from Pretty Little Thing. I have this big old Pretty Little Thing package. And I have a couple different items in here that I'm going to be using to recreate these outfits. Really excited. And I also have some other pieces in here as well that are just some things that I wanted to style myself and show you guys how I would style them. So I'm really excited. And it's been a minute since I've done a YouTube clothing haul. Let's be honest here. <laughs> I've been feeling a little uninspired. And I just wanted to, you know, get back into the groove of things. Get back into the flow of, you know, my fashion passion. On Bratz. I have a passion for fashion. I just had to find that spark again. But I have, and I'm so excited to bring another video to you guys. Hope you guys like it. Like I said, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And let's stop chatting. Let's get right on into the video. If you're a returning subscriber, you already know the deal. You already know how this go. But if you're new, I'm going to let you guys know how the recreating Pinterest outfits videos go so basically i show you guys the outfit i show you guys the items that i got to recreate the outfit and we're gonna rate it on a scale of one to ten to see how good i nailed recreating that fit so let's get into it this first outfit is really basic really calm really chill but you know you do need some chill things in your closet in your wardrobe because we are still very much in a global pandemic so you do need things that you can lounge around in in the house okay so i saw this calvin klein set on pinterest and basically it's a gray set but i'll show you guys how i finessed it to be like whatever you guys will see later this gray calvin klein set and the bands on both the top and the bottom say calvin klein and from pretty little thing i got this pretty little thing sports bra which is kind of similar to the calvin klein one in terms of like the style and like you know having the logo on the bands the only difference is that that the cup like the cups are different it's not like the same kind of sports bra shape and the straps do say pretty little thing i haven't tried this on yet so i'm kind of scared we just gonna see i also got the bottoms to match and i hope these leggings fit too because sometimes when you get like a set of something like the leggings and the top like one of them just gonna be off so i'm hoping both of them fit well um and it's really good quality like i don't think it's gonna be see-through like at all so really looking forward to this but i'm going to wear some black sweatpants with it and show you guys like this cool cute you know lounge around the house kind of fit going on okay I'm gonna show you guys and we're gonna rate this on the scale from let's put them side by side here so it's a different color so let's just let's look past it let's look past it it's a different color but I think that I nailed the what I was going for, you know, the whole sweatpants, casual, you know, matching the logos together. I, I think I hit it. Because it's not the same color, I'm going to give myself seven. But that's just me, personally, personally. Okay, so for this next outfit, we're kind of going to do something a little wee -de -wee -de -wee -de -wee -de -wee -de bit different. We're going to try and combine two outfits on Pinterest and recreate both of them to fit what I got from Pretty Little Thing. 
So in this first fit, this girl's wearing a brown jumpsuit and she has like a Louis fanny pack and also like some cream dad sneakers and some high socks or whatever. And in the other picture, the girl has on a fitted cap, um, a YSL like crossbody bag, um, same high socks and she also has on Jordans. I don't have Jordans, I don't have a fitted hat, I don't have a YSL bag, and I don't have a Louis fin pack. Y'all probably like, girl, what do you have then? Well, I'll show you. So, from Pretty Little Thing, I've been dying, literally dying to get my hands on this brown jumpsuit. I saw Angui wear this in one of her Pretty Little Thing hauls, and I had to have it, but it literally, it literally was sold out after I finished watching her haul video so I was literally like waiting for it to get back on the website so it's just this brown jumpsuit it fits divine and it has this um white um stitching in it as well and it also says pretty little thing if I could find which side it's on it also says pretty little thing in white writing as well and I'm pretty tall so it goes all the way down um and it also has armholes you guys will see in the try on portion when I show you guys the side by side but, so yeah, I'm going to wear this with my high knee socks and I'm also going to pair it with, I'm going to pair it with my lugged converses. I hope this doesn't look stupid. I'm going to pair this with my lugged converses and I'm also going to add something as well. I'm going to add my black puffer jacket. Do you have a black puffer jacket even? Do you have a big black puffer jacket even? But I'm going to add that to add a little bit of spice. Um, one thing that I advocate for in these videos is that it doesn't have to be to a T. It doesn't have to be exactly the same. You can add a little bit of your own flavor and style depending on what you have in your closet and what you own. You don't have to go out and buy each and every item the person is wearing in the picture because you can definitely find ways to make it your own with what you have. So period. So this is what it looks like side by side. <laughs> and honestly, I feel like the outfit is going to be cute. I feel like in terms of making it my own and, you know, finessing and making it like cool, I think that I'm going to give myself a 8. I don't know, but I think that I did a good job of, you know, recreating it and making it my own. But in terms of like nailing it, I'm gonna give myself like a three because I had none of the stuff that the girls were wearing except for the base um, item, but I feel like that's what you, that's mostly what you need. Sometimes all you need is the base and then you can add on what you wanna add on, like what I did. But let's move on because we've been on this too long. Okay, so this next outfit, I'm a little, this next outfit I'm a little bit scared of because I haven't really hit monochromatic vibes yet. But I'm kind of trying to step out of my comfort zone because spring is coming up and I kind of want to do add a little bit more color to my wardrobe. So let's just see. And this outfit, the girl has on a green blazer and it looks like a green um, sports bra under it. Some boyfriend jeans and it looks like it looks like Air Forces with like a black check on it. But we ain't gonna worry about all that. So from Pretty Little Thing, I do have this green blazer it's a boyfriend blazer i got it a while ago but i also got this uh, sage green crop top um short sleeve crop top i'm not too sure how this is gonna look now i'm not too sure but i'm also gonna pair it with my boyfriend jeans which i'll link down below they're not from pretty little thing and i'll also link down my air forces too but we're just gonna see how this fit goes honestly i'm looking at it right now i feel like i didn't hit it on the nail with the greens but I think that's what monochromatic is all about so hopefully it doesn't look bad so here is a side by side on what it looks like I think I haven't tried it on yet but I'm gonna give it a five because I really wish the greens match like it did in the picture like monochromatic is a little bit out of my comfort zone so for me I feel like things have to match I know other people are different a little like ah the colors are not the same one of these things is not like the other nonetheless I still do think it's pretty cute so I'm gonna give it a five in terms of you know recreating this fit in this outfit this girl is wearing a brown dress um and it looks like what are these shoes called loafers there we go <laughs> she's wearing like it looks like loafers and some black socks 
um and it looks like a brown bag as well so from pretty little thing i do have this brown high sleeve very 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 similar to the one that the girls bring in the picture and i'm going to wear it with and I'm going to wear it with this bag that, ooh, that's so cute. This bag I got from Shein, and I will link this down below. It's like a Louis Vuitton dupe, and I think this will go great with this outfit. I'm also going to pair it with my Dr. Martens. Let's just put it side by side. <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but I'm gonna give myself a 10 because the dress is giving body yadi yadi. Um, I literally hit it on the nail. Like, if I didn't zoom into that picture, I wouldn't even have realized that she's not wearing Dr. Martens. And I think Dr. Martens look really well with this dress. It helps casualize it a little bit because the slit is pretty high and the slit is doing a lot. But I think that it is Chef's Kiss, 10 out of 10. Let's move on. So that concludes all the Pinterest outfits that I have recreated. Let's move on to the rest of the items that I got from Pretty Little Thing. So I also got this orange sweat set. So this is the hoodie. It's a zip hoodie. Um, it's kind of like a muted orange. It's not like a neon orange, which I like. This is this is a really good piece for transitioning into the spring because you know the spring is still a little bit cold. Um, but you do want to wear like brighter colors to bring in the new brighter feeling that you get once you're relieved from the winter. Not really a colors gal, but I saw this and I was like, oh, this would go really really nicely with some um, Yeezys. I don't have Yeezys. I got a dupe from Ego Shoes. Um, it has not arrived yet. But I'm really, really excited when it does come because I'm going to pair it with this outfit. So make sure you follow me on my socials to see how I finessed it. And I'm going to show you guys the bottoms. Here is what the bottoms look like. It's just, oh, backwards. <laughs> Here's what the bottoms look like. They have these front pockets um, on the front so they're not like normal standard sweatpants pockets. So that gives it a little bit more character. And it has a little drawstring. It also has the um, cuffed bottom and I'm really I really am a sucker for a sweat set so I just had to get it honestly so the next set that I got is just like this oatmeal ribbed set it fits so nicely I don't know if I got I got a size small if it came in extra small I probably should have got the extra small but as you can see like it stretches a lot because it's so skinny right now you can't really see the true color can y'all see that it's coming up a little bit lighter on camera but it's really this oatmeal-y color and it also flares at the bottom it's not split hem thank god because i'm kind of getting out of the split hem vibe but um it's not split hem it's flare and i plan to pair this with my white air forces in a white bag and the top is so nice it's like this preppy like red collared button down it's just so girly and preppy like it has like this um lettuce trim like at the at the arms and at the bottom of um the top and it's so nice i cannot wait to show you guys how it looks because it fits like a glove next i have this set to show you guys but it did not fit me but i'll show you guys how it looks on the model it was entirely too small for me um i will be selling this on my poshmark which is always linked down below in the description but it's just like this asymmetrical like crop top it's it was the vision was there. I promise you the vision was there. It was giving very much Matrix. Um, and it also has like this metal thing that says pretty little thing on it. Um, it was really, really cute on the model. So I was really excited to get it myself. But it, it just didn't work out, y'all. Here are the bottoms. This is what the bottoms look like. They have like this cut out on the leg. The bottoms are entirely too big for me. I got a US size 2 and I don't even think if I size down to a 0 if it would fit me. I don't know. The next item that I have is something I'm very excited for because it's very much a statement and I feel like I know what I want to do with this. Like I think I might be onto something. It's just this corseted orange dress. So spring like love 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 it like me holding up does it no justice but it's a really really nice structured like quality dress but it's all the way down and it comes with this corset that also laces in the back and then the arms kind of do like this ruching like flared thing it's just a vibe on i'm sorry like this dress is every bit of me like just a little bit of color make a statement ruffles corset just like Everything that I could think of that is all me is in this dress. Like, 
love that for me last but not least i got some socks so i got these socks um let me take it out the pack here are the first pair of socks they just say pretty little thing on them and this is like a gucci like sock dupe um i got gucci money so this is just gonna have to do and these look so nice with like a white outfit and some like white air forces those are like those are every bit of me but um these are the socks that i got and i also got another pair like I said, my Yeezy dupes are coming, so I plan to wear these with the Yeezy dupes um, in the different outfits that I had in mind. And then here are the other pairs. The um, the white writing just says pretty little thing on it. A uh, freaking adorable. Are you kidding me? This is going to go so nice with the shoes. I'm going to show you guys the shoes on the side so you guys know what I'm talking about. Y'all have seen like, these shoes styled with these kind of socks before, so really 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 excited for this that concludes the end of this video i hope you guys enjoyed it i know it's a little bit long i hope you guys found some inspiration for you know the new season coming up and i'm so so excited to continue going on this road to 10k with you guys don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like and don't forget to comment down below because, you know, that's the, that's the normal routine. So, let's not break routine. And I will see you guys in my next video.